Let's leave it at that and now shift our focus. India's ambitious moon mission Chandrayaan-3 is inching close to the moon and will attempt a soft landing on the lunar surface on 23rd August. ISRO has shared new updates on the historic landing of the moon mission. All eyes will be on Chandrayaan-3 as it will descend on the moon's surface at around 6.04pm on 23rd August. Now, the update came just hours after the lander completed its second and final deboosting earlier this morning, reducing the moon's orbit to uh, 113 kilometers into 157 kilometers. Now, India will become the first country to successfully complete a soft landing on the moon's south pole. And while India's moon mission is all on track, Russia's moon mission, Luna 25, suffered a major setback and crashed on the moon. Russia's first moon mission in almost 50 years, Luna 25, 25 spun into an uncontrolled orbit during a pre-landing maneuver. The Russian space agency confirmed the spacecraft's crash, saying all communication with Luna 25 was lost at 2.57 p.m. and the lander ceased to exist following a collision with the moon's surface. The space agency said that measures were taken to locate the craft on 19th and 20th August, but all efforts were unsuccessful. With the Luna 25, Russia hoped to build on the legacy of its Soviet-era lunar program, marking a return to independent lunar exploration in the face of growing isolation from the West. Like Chandrayaan-3, Luna 25 too was att attempting a soft landing on the moon's south pole, competing for a spot in the history. ISRO has now announced the revised timing for the soft landing. That is August 23rd, 6.04 p.m. in the evening. Uh, this is when uh, Chandrayaan-3 is expected to make a soft landing near the south pole of the moon. So by 6.04 p.m. we'll be able to uh, you know, uh, see this uh, live in all of ISRO's uh, social media handles. And apart from that, uh, DD National will also be telecasting uh, you know, uh, uh, these visuals. Uh, so uh, uh, ISRO has now told the updated timing as you told, which is August 23, uh, 6, uh, uh, 4 p.m. I'm repeating, August 23, 6.04 p.m. in the evening is when uh, the soft landing of Chandrayaan-3 is expected to happen near the lunar uh, uh, near the south pole of the lunar surface. Uh, so definitely this is going to be a major feat for uh, you know India's space sector uh, globally uh, because you know recently there is information that uh, uh, Russia's Luna mission has uh, lost a touch with the uh, scientists uh, you know of the uh, Roscosmos. Uh, Russia uh, a few days back they, lo they launched the lunar mission and unfortunately we're given to understand that uh, you know their mission has uh, uh, lost touch. Uh, the, sat uh, the satellite has lost touch with the uh, Russian scientists and that, uh, that has been officially announced by uh, the Russian government. Uh, meanwhile, uh, the, Indians, uh, the Indian uh, satellite that is Chandrayaan-3 is successfully traveling uh, you know, uh, through space and it is, it, it is making its uh, movement, uh, movement towards uh, uh, the lunar surface and in next couple of days, that is on August 23 uh, by 6.04 p.m., uh, Chandrayaan-3 is expected to make a soft landing near the south pole of the moon and this will make India the first ever country to have landed a spacecraft near the south pole of the moon and as soon as uh, the Vikram lander lands, uh, the Pragyan rover will be released and the rover will, uh, you know, rove onto the surface of the moon while performing all the uh, required quantitative and qualitative experiments and the uh, inputs that we are able to get from Chandrayaan-3, uh, all the results of these experiments, uh, they will straight away be injected into the formulation and execution of a, a Gaganyaan mission. Uh, Gaganyaan is our next, you know, manned mission for moon. This will be our first manned mission for moon and uh, it is currently taking shape. The scientists are building it. The formulation is currently underway. Uh, so the inputs that we are able to take from Chandrayaan-3 will directly be uh, used for Gaganyaan mission it will be very crucial as what we're given to understand so uh, we're all waiting for august 3 uh, we've been waiting for the past almost 38 days and we only have two more days left for this uh, uh, history to be made